In this video, I'm going to show you how to share your iPhone screen, not via the normal AirPlay, but uh, basically the same way as in the new macOS version Sequoia, the behavior will be enabled, but you can do it on any macOS version. So as you can see, I'm sharing my iPhone screen here and it's literally just normal AirPlay. And you can see that here. And I will show you how to do this now. So first I close this real quick and then we can get started. So to begin with, you need a couple of things. First, you need to have Homebrew installed and you can do uh, install it very simple. So you copy this line of code here. You just click your copy, then you open the terminal and then you have the terminal here and you literally just paste this line of code. You press enter. I already have it installed, but the behavior is basically the same. So you have to type in the password, press enter. And now it's downloading and installing it. So we have it installed now. And the next step is to go on to Ami TV 87 PIP. So that stands for picture in picture. And it is based off uh, two other open source projects, uh, which is UX Play and AirPlay Server. Here we have them also linked. So they are bundled into this package. Basically UX Play is to enable uh, also AirPlay as a receiver, and then you have also AirPlay server here, which is a similar project. And it is basically uh, for having AirPlay working on other platforms. So this enables you to just have AirPlay running. Uh, and it has some interesting options also for Linux included, but UX Play is the main project, which is the backend for what we're doing here. And then it just has a nice application to run so you don't have to run terminal commands after the installation is done. And to install it, we literally just copy this code here. And then we go back into the terminal, paste it. Obviously I have it already installed, so it doesn't let me install, but for you, it will just be installed. It will run a couple of lines of code and then you will have the pip application install. After you installed pip and before you start pip, you should open the system settings and search for AirPlay. Click on AirPlay receiver, disable AirPlay receiver. And once you've done that, open the applications, find the applications here. Then we go look for pip. It's here. We click open. And for the first time open, it will ask you if you really want to open it because it doesn't come from an uh, approved developer. And then you just, uh, it will give you a little pop up here and then you, your application will start. And then you get this little window here. You can just close this. It's fine. It just needs the app to be open. Uh, and this doesn't close the app. Once you have done that, you go on your phone and you select AirPlay. I can show you what this looks like as soon as it is connected. So here we have my iPhone. So I literally just go uh, on the drop down menu, menu and then I select AirPlay. This is this button here. And then I can see my computer here. And then I click on it and then it takes a couple seconds and your screen sharing is working. This behavior will be exactly the same as in a new macOS Sequoia, but it has no restrictions on which macOS you're using and you can use it on Sonoma, Monterey and so on and so forth. No problem. I hope you like this video and if you really liked the video, I would really appreciate if you subscribe to my channel. Have a good day.